Oyao is the largest fishing port on the Algarve, and its market is one of the best I've ever seen. Now the building itself was said to have been designed by the same man who did the Eiffel Tower, Gustav Eiffel, but there's no real record of that. However, that doesn't make it any less beautiful. Let's check it out. The outside of the market is lined with cafes and bars. And the waterfront path is a good place to catch up with friends and take a walk. You can take a water taxi from here to explore the harbor, but the market was calling us. Once inside, you quickly get the idea that if it swims in the sea and is edible, you'll find it here. The sardines and anchovies are local specialties. The selection of fruits, vegetables, and meat is no less impressive. We left the market to explore the old part of town. Due to its unique North African style architecture, consisting of white houses with flat roofs attached to smaller rectangular structures called mirants, Oliao has been known for years as the Cubist city. The narrow alleyways are lined with sculptures celebrating old fishermen's tales of magical Moorish children and beautiful mysterious maidens. I was looking for a place called Vai e Volta, a restaurant that specializes in grilled fish, but we got hopelessly turned around. Until a friendly local set us straight. The place is known for its all-you-can-eat mixed grill. They just keep bringing all types of beautiful, fresh, char-broiled fish until you've had your fill. It makes for a memorable lunch. After lunch, we headed to the old canning factory neighborhood. Four local artists have created blocks of stunning black and white murals. Based on photographs in the city archives of life gone by in this fishing port. Some of the folks depicted on these walls still walk the streets of this neighborhood. Oyao is also known for its more contemporary graffiti street art. We headed out to a different part of town to see a few of these 
But I have to admit, I preferred the black and white historic murals. By the time we got back to Old Town, the light was fading and there was just enough time left to put up the drone for a couple of last looks at Ol Yao, the cubist town of the Algarve. <laughs> 